Hey guys, and welcome to another vlog. And today we are in the Audi R8 V10 Spider. It has the Estronic gearbox, it's a 2014 facelift car. Um, and yeah, this is the first time realistically that I'm getting to drive it properly. It's a Sunday, um, so I thought, why not? Let's take it out, make a little video for you guys, and um, check out what all the fuss is all about. This isn't a review, more like a vlog, but it might turn out better than a review. I don't know, we'll see. Anyway, the car is much quieter when it's in its um, normal um, normal mode, um, just as you're cruising along in auto. Um, the new Astronic gearbox has seven speed. Um, it's a seven speed gearbox. There we get the extra gear will give you better economy as well. Um, other than that, I mean, the gear shifts are really, really smooth. Check this, ready? So we're in second right now. That was a change of gear there. The camera didn't even move. Now, if it did, it was probably because of the acceleration. The previous Artronic uh, gearbox, a downshift, and it will be really sluggish. Well, it wasn't really sluggish. Okay, I do know my way home now. Would you like to shut up? That's good. Yeah, it was actually, um, it's not sluggish, but it had a little bit of a delay. It was a little bit more clunky. But this, this is fantastic. The Astronic gearbox, it really is something else. Obviously, we can put the car in sport mode. Um, there it is, to uh, open up some of the valves, make the car a little bit louder, and then you get this orgasmic sound. You ready? Sounds good. Downshift. Phenomenal, phenomenal shifts. Really are super, super quick, super smooth. Um, and makes the driving experience so much better um, in the new RA. I've previously had um, a V8 RA Coupe, sold that, um, had two RA Spiders. They were both V10 Artronics, uh, and I have to say that this one is the best one that I've had so far. Uh, again, finished in black with the all black interior, red stitching. Um, I like it. Obviously, the other changes as well that we'll show you once we get to the showroom at Pet HQ um, are the exhausts. They're there instead of being oval, they are now circular. And then we also have uh, what else is different on this? The, the, the side mirrors. Um, the side mirrors are actually a different shape now, a lot more aesthetically pleasing, uh, slicker, I suppose, better aer aerodynamics for that sort of stuff. They're finished in carbon, genuine carbon fiber, not carbon dipped or, or anything like that. Even the, the previous uh, R8, the candy apple red one that I had, you guys may remember, had the um, carbon dip. Uh, mirrors which look fantastic um, great substitute to the carbon fiber but uh, this is the, the real deal let's check this out side of things it is quattro sticks to the road like glue I've always loved the R8s and I've always said that it's um, it's a car that has really made an impact um, in the last decade to the automotive industry it's a real staple supercar sports car slash everyday car it's very usable you can you know use it to go to the shops to uh, you know turn up to meetings and just drive it about every day um, obviously the advantages of having the spider is that um, you know dropping the roof down when the weather's beautiful as you can see we have um, mixed emotions from the weather here actually uh, it's raining we have the sun out very confused weather so um, yeah it's unlikely that we will take this roof down today but when the weather is nice it's always nice to take the roof down um, obviously with the spider 
uh, the chassis loses uh, rigidness uh, a little bit. So, I mean, in terms of uh, the, the coupe handling compared to the Spider, there is a slight difference, uh, but not something that a driver um, on day-to-day -day, uh, road driving would notice so much. Um, again, you know, speed, you know, it's amazing. The V10 engine, fantastic engine. Really, really impressed with this. Um, I'll do an in-depth review on this very, very soon. But right now, we're heading over to Pet HQ where we will uh, we'll jump out, show you around the car a, a little bit more in depth. Um, it's a little bit filthy, so we might even give it a quick rinse as well. I'm here with Abuzar. Abuzar, thank you for holding the camera for this long, mate. I know yeah, you yeah, okay, no. must be a bit tiring. But yeah, let's head over to Pet HQ. Ah, what are you doing? End it. <laughs> So we're now at PET, um, the car obviously is now in the wash bay, it's only right that we give it a quick rinse over, I was going to give me a hand, yep. I think it's only right that we give it, <laughs> you went up for that, I just put you into that, um, it's only right that we give it a quick rinse over before we show you the car, don't really want to show you whilst it's dirty, the weather outside has been atrocious, check that out, there's a lot of, uh, lot of muck on the car, so yeah, we're going to give it a quick rinse over and then uh, show you around the car a little bit. By the way, just before anyone asks, that is the registration with what we bought the car with. Obviously, um, that won't be a stain on the car. Um, obviously, we need a pet plate um, as it's for the, um, for the company. You can um, obviously hire this vehicle as well. Um, you can obviously head on to, to uh, www.platinumet.co.uk. We've got a new website coming up, so before anyone asks, there is a lot of issues with that one, but we've got a new one coming up. So yeah, do check that out. Um, Let's give it a quick rinse. Have it quickly rinsed over the car. Check out the wheels now. Oh wow. Polished wheels. Bling bling. Yeah, we didn't we didn't soap it off because it's gonna get washed over by the uh, by the cleaners tomorrow. Gave it a quick little rinse over. Let's uh, let's play outside and give you a uh, a proper viewing. What do you think, guys? I tell you what, we haven't done a bad job for just a, uh, a water off, a rinse off. So I've just got my friend now to pull the car out. I'll show you it in a little bit more detail. I think pulling it outside would probably be better. Park it up here. The real purpose of me actually rinsing the car off primarily was for the wheels. So I wanted to show you these wheels in a little bit more detail. Check them out. These are polished. You can get them in diamond cut versions as well. Um, but uh, this uh, very car has the, has, the, um, has the polished wheels on, which look fantastic. Uh, as you can see, a lot of shine on it. Get up close. You can see. Very nice. Um, we've got the carbon mirrors. Show you that in the. Uh, the previous video we've got like this uh, the gloss black pack on it as well as you can see oval ex um, circular exhaust instead of oval oh. what's that doing <laughs> all right mate um yeah what else oh the lights how can we forget the lights i was gonna put the lights on if you don't mind there we go Oh, the, oh, I think I think I know I know I know why I know why I know why I'll change it I'll do it I'll do it I'll do it, I'll do it. they're not on auto are they on now no maybe I should just put them on that's better okay check those lights out imagine that just pulling up into your uh, rear view mirror looks very uh, very aggressive you look nice in a suit pal. <laughs> um, and the uh, lights on the back as well 
look very very smart. I, I was alright, just put on the um, on the indicators, one of the indicators, I want to show them the, uh, the difference. Did you just come off a job? Yeah, I just, uh, <laughs> Check that. So like, it's, as you can see, it just starts from there, it goes like lasers. Awesome. Right, I'm going to show you inside the car now. Let's have a quick look. Oh, God. As you can see, again, lots of Audi in the car. Obviously, it's an Audi car, so it's got to have Audi in the car, so start it up. Dials just calibrate themselves there. And there we go. It's good to know the passenger airbag is on. Um, we have like a uh, a gloss black finish here around the uh, around the gear stick. Uh, previous R8s that I've had have had those in aluminium. We have an aluminium um, gear shift. Um, <laughs> I'm not going to say it because I remember the last time I did that. I couldn't stop laughing, very immature of me. Got the uh, the red stitching, leather all down the sides. Um, let's just pop down the roof. Oh God. And there we have it. And then before you know it, all we need now is some good LA weather. Oh, it's actually not too bad now, but don't let the video fool you, it is quite chilly. Oh dear. Yeah. Let's shoot the car. Looks very, very nice with the roof down as well as up. Obviously, we have the posts finished in a brushed aluminium. Is it brushed? No, it's just a, a high polished um, frame. So. Yeah, guys, that's about it. Hopefully, I will review more of this. Here we go. Uh, we have the Audi R8 there for you. A very quick um, insight into the car. I'm going to be doing a few more videos um, of this very soon. Some reviews. Um, so, yeah, if you like today's video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, share. Um, and I'll see you soon for another video. Um, before we end it off, might as well give them a few revs. Yeah, it's only right. Mm-hmm.